The moon, our celestial neighbor, has captivated humanity for millennia. Its silvery glow has inspired countless dreams and aspirations. For centuries we gazed upon it from afar, its secrets veiled in mystery. But in the 20th century, we finally broke free from Earth's embrace and set foot on the lunar surface. The Apollo missions marked a pivotal moment in human history, a testament to our indomitable spirit of exploration. Today, a new era of lunar exploration is dawning. We are returning to the moon, this time to stay. Our ambitions extend beyond fleeting visits. We envision a permanent human presence on the lunar surface, a thriving lunar outpost that will serve as a stepping stone for further ventures into the cosmos. This ambitious endeavor demands innovative solutions, bold ideas that can transform our lunar aspirations into tangible realities. Project Float envisions a lunar railway system unlike any on Earth. The Moon Railway could see a floating robot tray transporting lunar regolith, meaning the rock and dust on the surface of the Moon, for construction or research, a technology that uses powerful magnets to suspend and propel trains without any physical contact with the tracks. This eliminates friction, allowing for incredibly smooth and rapid transit. On the Moon, where gravity is a mere sixth of Earth's, maglev trains could glide effortlessly across the lunar landscape, reaching speeds that would be unimaginable on Earth. These lunar trains would not resemble the conventional carriages we are accustomed to. Instead, Project Float proposes modular transport units, versatile pods that can be customized for various purposes. These units could carry cargo, transport astronauts, or even serve as mobile laboratories. Their modular design allows for flexibility and adaptability, catering to the evolving needs of a lunar outpost. Maglev technology is not new. It has been employed in high-speed trains on Earth for several decades. However, its application on the Moon presents unique opportunities and challenges. The Moon's low gravity reduces the energy required for levitation, making maglev an ideal choice for lunar transportation. Furthermore, the absence of air resistance allows for incredibly high speeds with minimal energy expenditure. The maglev system envisioned for Project Float would utilize superconducting magnets to generate powerful magnetic fields. These fields would interact with coils embedded in the tracks, creating a repulsive force that lifts the train slightly above the rails. Once levitated, the train can be propelled forward by varying the magnetic fields along the track, creating a wave of magnetic energy that pushes the train along. The modular transport units at the heart of Project Float are designed for versatility and adaptability. They are essentially self-contained pods that can be attached to the maglev train and customized for various purposes. This modularity allows for efficient allocation of resources and ensures that the lunar railway can cater to the evolving needs of a lunar outpost. Cargo units could be designed to transport various materials, from construction supplies and scientific equipment to lunar regolith and extracted resources. These units could be equipped with specialized loading and unloading mechanisms, facilitating the efficient transfer of goods between different locations on the Moon. Section 5. The Power of the Sun. Fueling Lunar Journeys. Energy is a precious commodity in space exploration. Every watt of power must be generated, stored, and used with utmost efficiency. Project Float addresses this challenge by harnessing the abundant solar energy that bathes the Moon's surface. Solar power is a clean, sustainable, and reliable energy source, making it an ideal choice for powering the Lunar Railway. Vast arrays of solar panels would be deployed along the Lunar Railway, capturing sunlight and converting it into electricity. These panels would be strategically positioned to maximize sunlight exposure, ensuring a continuous supply of power for the maglev trains. The electricity generated by the solar panels would be stored in high-capacity batteries, providing a buffer for periods when sunlight is not available. This energy storage system would ensure that the maglev trains can operate continuously, even during the lunar night, which lasts for approximately 14 Earth days. Section 6. Enduring the Lunar Extremes. Building for the Long Haul. The Moon's environment is harsh and unforgiving. It is characterized by extreme temperature fluctuations, ranging from scorching heat during the lunar day to frigid cold during the lunar night. Micrometeoroid bombardment is a constant threat, as tiny particles of space debris rain down on the lunar surface at high speeds. Furthermore, abrasive lunar dust, composed of sharp, jagged particles, poses a significant challenge to mechanical systems. 
To withstand these challenges, the infrastructure of Project Float must be incredibly robust and durable. The tracks would be constructed from materials specifically chosen for their resistance to temperature extremes, impact stresses, and abrasion. Advanced alloys, ceramics, and composites could be employed to ensure the long-term viability of the railway system. The tracks would be designed to minimize dust accumulation, incorporating features that prevent dust from settling on the rails and interfering with the maglev system. Special coatings could be applied to the tracks to reduce friction and prevent wear from abrasive lunar dust. Automation is a key element of Project Float, enabling efficient and reliable operation of the Lunar Railway with minimal human intervention. Advanced artificial intelligence systems would play a crucial role in managing the railway, controlling train movements, monitoring system performance, and responding to unforeseen events. AI-powered control systems would optimize train schedules, ensuring efficient routing and minimizing energy consumption. These systems would monitor track conditions, identifying potential hazards or maintenance needs, and alerting human operators if intervention is required. Autonomous navigation systems would guide the maglev trains along the tracks, maintaining precise speed and positioning. These systems would utilize a combination of sensors, cameras, and GPS-like technology to navigate the lunar terrain and avoid obstacles. Project Float is not merely a concept confined to a single railway line. It is envisioned as a scalable transportation network, capable of expanding to meet the evolving needs of a growing lunar outpost. As lunar exploration progresses and new sites of interest are discovered, the railway can be extended to connect these locations, facilitating exploration and resource extraction. The modular design of the transport units allows for flexibility in adapting to new demands. As new technologies emerge and the requirements of the lunar outpost evolve, new types of transport units can be developed and integrated into the railway system. The lunar railway could eventually extend beyond the immediate vicinity of the lunar outpost, reaching remote regions of the moon, including the lunar poles, which are believed to harbor vast reserves of water ice. Project Float represents a bold vision for the future of lunar exploration, it is a testament to human ambition, our unwavering pursuit of knowledge, and our determination to push the boundaries of what is possible. The Lunar Railway promises to revolutionize how we explore the Moon, unlocking countless opportunities for scientific discovery, resource utilization, and human expansion into the cosmos. The efficient transportation provided by the Lunar Railway would facilitate the construction and expansion of lunar outposts, accelerating the development of a permanent human presence on the Moon. It would enable the efficient movement of resources, equipment, and personnel, supporting a wide range of activities, from scientific research to industrial development. The Lunar Railway could play a crucial role in resource extraction, transporting lunar regolith, water ice, and other valuable materials from extraction sites to processing facilities. This would contribute to the development of a lunar economy, reducing reliance on Earth-based resources and paving the way for self-sufficiency on the Moon. As we stand on the cusp of a new era of lunar exploration, Project Float emerges as a beacon of innovation and ingenuity. The vision of a railway on the moon, once a distant dream, is now within our grasp. Thanks to advances in technology and our unwavering determination to explore the cosmos, the Lunar Railway promises to transform how we explore the moon, enabling us to traverse its rugged terrain with unprecedented ease and efficiency. It is a testament to human ambition, our unwavering pursuit of knowledge, and our collective spirit of exploration. Project Float is not merely a transportation system. It is a symbol of our enduring fascination with the moon, our desire to unravel its mysteries, and our ambition to establish a lasting human presence beyond Earth. It represents a giant leap for humankind, a testament to our ability to overcome challenges, push the boundaries of what is possible, and reach for the stars. As we embark on this new chapter of lunar exploration, let us embrace the bold vision of Project Float, a lunar railroad that will pave the way for a future where humanity thrives not only on Earth, but also on the Moon and beyond. The journey ahead is filled with challenges, but the rewards are immeasurable. The Moon awaits, and with it, a universe of possibilities.